rate of change rock. The rate of change rock is calculated by taking the difference between the current closing price and the closing price and periods ago, and then dividing it by the closing price and periods ago. The result is then multiplied by 100 to express it as a percentage. The ROC measures the percentage change in price over a specific period. Positive values indicate upward momentum, suggesting an increase in price, while negative values indicate downward momentum, suggesting a decrease in price. Traders use ROC to identify overbought and oversold conditions, potential trend reversals, and to confirm the strength of price movements. Traders can utilize the ROC in various ways to generate trading signals. Here are a few common strategies. Overbought and oversold conditions. Uh, traders monitor the ROC to identify overbought and oversold conditions. When the ROC reaches high positive values, it suggests the market is overbought and may be due for a potential reversal or correction. Conversely, when the ROC reaches low negative values, it suggests the market is oversold and may be due for a potential reversal or bounce. ROC crossovers though. Traders look for crossovers of the ROC line with the zero line as potential entry or exit signals. When the ROC crosses above the zero line, it may indicate a bullish signal, suggesting an increase in upward momentum or potential trend reversal. Conversely, when the ROC crosses below the zero line, it may indicate a bearish signal, suggesting an increase in downward momentum or potential trend reversal. Understanding and utilizing the rate of change rock is crucial for traders as it provides insights into market momentum and potential trend reversals. By incorporating the ROC into their analysis, traders can make more informed trading decisions, identify overbought and oversold conditions, and generate trading signals. However, it is important to consider the limitations of the indicator and use it in conjunction with other tools and techniques. Remember, continuous learning, practice, and adapting to market conditions are key to becoming a successful trader. Don't forget to subscribe to be notified of new videos.